Hey, I'm Ryan from Synthetic World 859, and today I'm going to show you how to make the bass patch from my song called How. I used a Prophet 6 to make this patch, but you could make it with just about any synth that has two oscillators, an LFO, envelope generated pitch modulation, voice stacking unison mode, and a touch of reverb. Start by making a dark ass detune patch. Here's the one that I made. This is six voices at once. Here it is with just one. It's a pretty simple patch. It's just two saw waves tuned to the same frequency. I mean, you can see that it's a little out of tune, uh, so it phases a little bit. Ah! And I got some oscillator slop on here too. Don't forget the slop. Uh, but we just want some phasing between the two oscillators. But you want to turn one of them up or down to taste. Make it bouncy by adding some pitch modulation with the LFO. I only put it on one oscillator because the phasing is less invasive to the recording process that way. Next we want to set the envelope. These are my settings right here. I made the release on the amp slightly shorter than on the filter, and I did the opposite for the decay, so I can play the patch more like an instrument than a computer. Set your low pass filter to get the amp envelope. I like half keyboard tracking here. Next, we can thicken up the attack by adding in some extra pitch modulation from the filter envelope. And we can thin out the tail by setting the high pass filter to get the inverse envelope. If you don't have a high pass filter on your synth, then you can do something similar by making your amp envelope decay and release settings slightly shorter than the filter envelopes. Now let's hollow it out a little bit by using a bunch of oscillators in unison. And finally, add a touch of reverb. And that's it. A quick word of advice. When mixing these kinds of patches, you'll basically always benefit from a little compression. The new Korg Prolog actually has a built-in compressor, and I think it's for this reason. I think it's for this kind of patch. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.